I'm a Joanne, I'm an artist um, and a researcher, and I work around the critical issues of technology and how the entanglement between technology, human and non-human agency, and climate change um, play together, and capital, capitalism. So the Hidden Life of Phenomenon is a user that was created during a residency at Impact. So this project, what you see, it's the result of a very um, simple purchase in Amazon. So every time you purchase or you make any an acquisition in Amazon, the interface or the website might you go through different interfaces. So I try to calculate the energy impact of this purchase together with all the hidden layers of code that made this purchase uh, possible. Just for 12 interfaces, which is 12 pages, yeah. So you go into a website, uh, you look for a book, you buy a book, you confirm your order, you get confirmation of order, etc., etc. I could uh, intercept 10,000 pages of written code. Yeah, it's what we can see in the exhibition. So it's like a huge tower of code. And this is just by doing the minimum amount of purchase. So these companies, uh, Amazon, Facebook, Google, and the likes, um, in the case of Amazon, they just not make money out of uh, selling retail, but also by uh, analyzing your behavior. And there is another layer out of that. It's not just that we perform free labor, let's say, for them, but parts of the energy needed to uh, perform this also falls on us. So this is what we can see in this piece. So I use mainly my computer, uh, my browser, then analytics software that basically you can even find in your browser, yeah, like network analysis um, and so on. And then for the energy part, I use a very simple device that allows you to calculate the energy cost. I mean, what your computer is actually uh, using to perform certain uh, processes. When we go to a website, we say we'll go to a website, but that's not generally true. Like the website is actually coming to visit us in our computer, yeah. All these codes and um, all these images that Amazon is showing you on the website, uh, they're installed in our computers. And all these algorithms, cooking, scripts that allow for the data to be transported to their servers also falls uh, partially in our computers. And that's like a very hidden layer. Yeah, that's why I call the hidden life of an Amazon user. Because you just don't see all the code responsible for tracking you and extracting information out of you, also for serving products and so on, but also the energy cost. You can't really understand or criticize the system if you don't understand it very well, because then you don't understand what you're criticizing. So even though most of my projects start from intuition, uh, then they're very much backed by research. And research involves a lot of artistic practice, yeah, especially what we're talking about uh, technological uh, infrastructures. Uh, you really need to understand how these are built in order to, to provide just tools or awareness on how this really works and what is important to fight against. 